Good morning. I hope everybody who's watching this video is doing well. For those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Sid DeMeo and I'm a graduate of the class of 2019. I'm currently a sophomore here in Omaha at UNO. Growing up, I attended Catholic grade school leading up to my high school decision where I um, decided to continue my Catholic education at Mount Michael. I spent four years at Mount Michael, so I know what it's like and I also know how well it prepares you um, for the next step in your life, uh, whether that's college or the workplace, whatever that may be, it prepares you very well for that. When Father John asked me if I would speak uh, for Catholic Schools Week, I wasn't really sure what to expect, but I was very honored, um, and I thought it was a pretty cool way, even if it's just a small little speech, a cool way to give back to the school and community that gave me so much and prepared me so well for college. One of the things that Father John wanted me to talk about was um, playing football and playing sports in the Catholic school environment, uh, especially at Mount Michael. Um, and I think the thing that I wanted to touch on was just something that you football players know about, and that's going to Mass on the morning of a game day, um, and how important of a tradition that's kind of become because of how it kind of reaffirms our Catholic identity. It's a great way to start the day uh, get your mind right and just focused um, before you start and play that game on Friday night. So I also know that the monastic community was always very happy to see the football team there and be able to give some words of encouragement during the homily and uh, after after Mass. So that's definitely a tradition I hope lives on with the football team and any other teams that do something like that. The last thing I wanted to talk about um, was just my experience with Catholic schools in general. Um, I don't think anyone will argue that going to a Catholic school gives you the best learning environment and learning experience you can possibly have. Um, it's just a, the environment's filled with people who um, just want you to succeed both academically and spiritually, which is the more important of the two. Um, I, I think the biggest thing when you move on from Mount Michael is you can tell the people who have been in an environment where They've been pushed uh, to become better learners and more motivated. Um, and you, It's pretty easy to tell when they haven't been in that environment. So I think that having a Catholic education, especially at a place like Mount Michael, um, you are definitely prepared to be a leader in the classroom um, among your peers or in the workplace among coworkers. Um, <clears throat> so, I've definitely been so thankful to have a Catholic education, especially at Mount Michael. I'm definitely so thankful. So, uh, d during this Catholic Schools Week, that's something that shouldn't be taken for granted. So, hope all you students just, you know, have have that. Uh, remember how lucky you guys are to be able to have such a good education. So, good luck as you complete this second semester, and go Knights.